Welcome back. Today I want to go over the AIM Surplus Nickel Boron Bolt Carrier Groups. As you can see, I got two of them here and I really like these bolt carrier groups. I've got a couple of hundred rounds through both of these and I haven't had the issue. The nice thing about the nickel boron coating is when you take them apart, pretty much they wipe clean. And that makes it really easy for cleaning. Even though they say it's self-lubricating, I still put oil on the rails here and here. Because I'm also a car guy and to me, any metal on metal, you need oil, so I still lubricate them. So here in a second, I'll give you some specs on different parts of this bolt carrier. First thing I want to look at is the firing pin. The firing pin is made of 8640 tool steel and it's hardened chrome to mill spec. That is a pretty looking firing pin right there. Nice and straight. Can't beat that. The next thing I want to go over is the cam pin. The cam pin is made of uh, 4340 steel. It's got nickel boron coating too. And the whole thing is done in it. All nice pretty and that nickel boron is slick. Looks like a pretty good cam pin there. Okay, now we're going to take a look at the bolt. This is all nickel boron too. Nice and slick. Gas O-rings look real good. Seal up nice and tight inside the carrier. Nice tight extractor. The ejector is nice and tight. This extractor, I would say you should be able to rip any kind of rounds out, steel or brass with no problems. And here's some specs on it. It is shot peen. It's a MPI bolt. The extractor does have a no ring in it. That's why it's nice and tight. Looks like a pretty nice bolt right there. So next, let's look at the actual bolt carrier. Okay, taking a look at the bolt carrier. You can see the nickel boron finish it is all over it. Makes it nice and slick. Probably can't get a real good picture of it, but the inside is chrome lined. Yep, I can't get the light to hit it, but that's chrome lined. Staking on these look like they're, uh, looks like the bolts ain't going to go nowhere. The bolts are a grade 8 fastener, so we'll take a look at this one too. This one looks like the staking might be a little bit better on it. Now on the gas key, the gas key is machined from billet. It is made from 4140. And it does have, like I said, the grade 8 fasteners in it. So that makes it good for the gas key. The carrier is uh, made from 8620 steel. Seems to be a pretty good steel. I would say for general purpose planking, and if it came down to it, this is going to be a great bolt for you to uh, buy. Last time I checked on their website, it was uh, $99.95 plus shipping. I'll leave a picture in at the end so you can see. And that's all I got for you today. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all on the next one.